Okay, uh, good morning uh, everyone. So this is a 2002 Honda Civic. So complain of this car, it has a clunking sound. So this is a very like a common problem of uh, every car. So the way I diagnose uh, for a clunking sounds of a car, it's very uh, straightforward. So you can hear the clunking sound when you like run over into a uh, a humps and the sound is coming from the front so the way I diagnose it if you watch my uh, previous video it's very simple guys so and the most common uh, culprit or the mo most common problem of this is it has a broken uh, stabilizer link bar so the way I check it is this so the way I do is like this so you can hear the uh, clunk so it's coming from the driver's side part so I'm gonna uh, bring my camera over there and I'm gonna you know push this uh, car uh, vertically from that part so you can hear it coming from here hold on I'm gonna shake the car So as you hear it, it's coming from here. So that's how you diagnose a clunking sound of a, a car. So it this will you know apply to any any model, any any car. So that's how you like you know confirm it. So it's coming from there. So we're just gonna uh, relocate this car. Maybe back it up, put it on my garage, and then let's check that uh, that side. All right, so I already removed the tire, but when I check the stabilizer link bar, it's still good. I don't see any play. I even use a pry bar and nothing, no play at all. But then, when I check in this, take a look at this, this one. When I did try to like move it, I can. I found this out, look <laughs> What the heck? So it's not the stabilizer link bar, but it's the lower control arm. Look at that. It's broken. That's what makes the this one. This what makes the car clunk. See this. Going up. Going down. <laughs> it's broken. Right there. So let's replace the lower control arm. So not all clunking sound is coming from your stabilizer link bar. Sometimes also it's coming from the lower control arm. So every car has every has a different design, and this is common to Hondas. I think because of the design. All right, so let's remove 
lower control arm. So let's start with this. It's this uh, stabilizer link bar. Let's remove that first. Need a light right there. So I think this is twin 14. Let me check. The bingo! It's almost there. So I'm using this 14 millimeter wrench and Allen wrench. This one. I don't know what number is this. Alright. Now it's this. Using this, what number is this? This is okay. 316. 316 Allen wrench or key. Let's remove this. Oh, oh come on, baby. At least ada tiran tahun. Kalau mau Una naman iwanan ko, nariga mo nang gigidan tayo amay, agigidan kayo. Nagkuha ko na ka, nariga ti agbisita, nung madaw ko, agigidan kayo. No, no, ato una eh. Arbein din lang alam ka, nariga tayo. Alam mo pala, nakakasarili eh. Ngayon, madi pa pa kami diyos to na, nariga doon pa yung kasi, ay, kuha. Dapat dya eh. Oo, yun. Adi, yung pasyermin ah, ito yung di may dapat. Ay, dya ako ah, rik, sinsini ka. Oo, yun. Yung sinsini ka rin. West can, yeah. That one also Indian one, right? Yeah. Yeah. They're all Indian. This guy also. This one is really tight. Yeah. This this one. Yeah. It's really tight. I have to like do it slowly. Otherwise, I'm gonna if I break it, you yeah. have to change it. Yeah. The back will okay, get right in the back. Everything, everything will okay. back. Please. Oh yeah, this one. Uh, no, uh, I can say. Oh, I mean like on the rear one. Maybe 30 minutes. Okay. So, yeah, just keep on look at me. Eh? <laughs> just, just keep on you know, looking at me. Yeah, yeah. So, this one we're using hold on, clear up 19 millimeter wrench. And after that, we can use this 19 millimeter socket. Same thing in here, on the other one over here, the bottom. That's 19 millimeter too. And this one underneath, right here, over here. I think that's number 17. 
Uh, yeah, it's number 17. So using 19 and 17. There you go. Now, hold on. I don't know if you can see it. There you go. Oh shit. Maybe put it on the side. Move it. Slide it. There you go. All right. Whew, look at this. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. It's broken. How about here? This one's still good. All right. Let's get the new one. Compare it. See? Perfect. All right. Now let's slide it. So let's stop this just a little. There you go. Perfect. Let's line up. Nice. Actually, they're the same. Same size of bolt. Yeah. Alright. Use this right here. See it? You don't see it. Right there. Nice. And this one. Here, all right. So every bolt is back now. So the one is still loose. Even the one right there. Then I already also put this one. Where was that? This one. So I'm super lucky. Yeah, it went on very easily. Because some some of this it's really hard to you know align this one but as for me I started with this then this one then this one and last one is this so it's pretty much easy so I just use my favorite pry bar to just align it and of course Homer yeah so that's pretty much it so I'm just gonna put them together and then let's uh, test let's like push this up and down and let's hear or listen if there's still a clunking sound but I'm pretty sure almost 100% the problem is already fixed because you, you, we saw it this one is broken right there lower control arm not the stabilizer link bar let's see oh, no more no more <laughs> no more before they point 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 you can try for yeah. this let's drive it Alright, uh, let's test drive it. Let's see if there's still a clunking sound. And no more. This bump. 
<laughs> yeah, there's no more. So that's how you fix a clunking sound of Honda 2000, I think this 2 or 1. 01 to 05 uh, Honda Civic. So it's not always a uh, stabilizer link bar. But now at least you have an idea. So different car, uh, different uh, problem, even though they have the same uh, sounds, not necessarily all our stabilizer link bar so guys that's it so if you have any question any suggestion uh, please comment down below and consider like and subscribe my channel too that's all for today and see you on my next video bye, -bye.